Hi there, so a common question that I get, you know, how can I master UberX and the Lyft regular category in Los Angeles and surroundings? Now don't box yourself in on just one platform, Uber, you want to be on both. If something for some reason happens on the one, you have technical difficulties, your app's not working, you can always switch over. But if you drive both platforms simultaneously, whichever one goes off first, you satisfy that tip, you do your very best so that you collect on tips. Now the tips are not huge in the UberX category, but if you're offering tip-top service, smiling at the people, being nice, you can expect a couple of dollars, especially if you drop a person off at the airport. Now the one thing I always tell UberX or Lyft drivers in Los Angeles and surroundings, could be Orange County, San Diego, Ventura, Santa Barbara, is know when you drop that client off, okay, know the very, very next busiest spot, right? If I'm dropping someone off in Westwood, I know UCLA is right there. If I'm dropping off someone at, um, at USC, at the college, I know that Figueroa downtown is just around the corner, right? If I'm dropping someone off in Culver City, you know that, know that the Westfield Mall or the West LA College is right there. You always want to work towards that next uh, trip. You don't want downtime. You don't want to sit in a quiet neighborhood and think, okay, well, I'm going to sit here and just wait. You, you're losing time, right? You may not be burning gasoline, but in this game, time is money. You always want to uh, spend two to five minutes to get to the next hotspot. So knowing a city inside out is crucial. Knowing your 30-day calendar from the 1st till the 30th of every month is crucial. What do I mean by that? You know, you can transfer all your music events, your concert events, your sports events for all the event arenas, whether it's, you know, Staples Center, Rose Bowl, Forum, Amphitheater, Hollywood Bowl, Microsoft Theater, Dodger Stadium, you need to be on top of all of those dates. A great uh, a reference would be StubHub. They have a wide selection of events on that website and you transfer those into your Google Calendar so you know, okay, on a Tuesday night, Maroon 5 played at Forum. Uh, they're coming out at 11 p.m., right? And you will see there will be a lot of cars waiting because that's a guaranteed long trip out of there and you're gonna hit prime time or surge. So think smart in this game. If you have any questions about LA, if you really want to know how to crank up the earnings, we can gladly meet, we can have a chat on the phone. All I ask you is to sign up under my code, under my Uber and Lyft code, and I will gladly take the time and uh, walk you through the city. What needs to be done, know your when and where factors, right? Um, I see a lot of people starting off and yes, they, you know, they get a lot of anxiety in those first two or three trips and they may even give up. Um, that's because they pretty much haven't prepared themselves. If you have been well prepared for the city, if you know what awaits you, it's a breeze. You can easily do 15, 20 trips per day. And if you do great trips, great service, you can also expect good tips. So for UberX, Lyft Regular, please contact me. I'm the ride share professor if you want to join. My links are right beneath this video. And we can immediately discuss how you can earn more money. Drive safe, my friends. Have a fantastic day.